I sure wish there was a way that I can make popcorn when I go camping. Now you can with the Stoke Voltaics electric kettle. <laughs> this isn't your ordinary electric kettle because there are three settings to this amazing design where you can heat up drinks, heat up food, and even pop popcorn. As you can see, it is beautiful in its color. This is the black and kind of like an orange logo. Drew, Drew's 1840 manuscript on heat and electricity. Kiwi goes I square RT, Drew. All right, as you can see, it's got a very nice nylon handle right here. Okay, let's go ahead and pop open the top. Oh, so that's, you have got an electric cord right here, three prong. That must mean, must mean it's heavy duty. And of course, the user's manual. Oh, cool. Okay, look at that. Look at that interior. Stainless steel material even sh shows the volume amount, okay, that you can uh, use it looks like it goes up to 16 ounces or 473 milliliters. Okay, all right, so you can cook plenty of food. Here's what the bottom look like with some rubber padding, and here are some of the electrical components 500 watts, 100, about 120 volts. Okay, very nice indeed. Like I mentioned, drink, eat, and pop. Okay, Stoke Photonics, and that must be the on off switch. Simply change that. Let's go ahead and um plug this in and test it out oh cool yeah so this is kind of like a kind of like a sleeve kind of nylon sleeve that protects it in case it gets hot i'm super excited about this and here's the cap too got ventilation hose even have a nice a little carry um, handle everything is so well thought after all right guys it's a beautiful day i'm in my backyard so just imagine i'm camping let's go ahead and test out this electric kettle so first i'm going to plug in the cord in the back all you have to do is remove the cover line it up and connect it to a power source so what i'm going to do is select the drink mode okay that's what i'm doing now i'm going to pour in cold tap water right here 16 ounce capacity I'm gonna put the cover on and I'm gonna press the power button. Okay, see how that turned on? Now I'm gonna use my timer and see how long it takes to boil the water. All right, let's check up on it near the five minute mark. Oh yeah, that's boiling water right there. Don't worry, automatically shuts off. That is good right there. Next, we have the eat mode. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose that. All right, now I'm gonna put in my water. You can probably do this similar with soup too. So 16 ounce capacity right here, 473 milliliters. This is cold tap water. So basically what it does is boil the water and then you can add your favorite food such as instant noodles so what i'm using today is the annie chun's noodle bowl that's my test so we're going to let that boil first so we already know it's going to take about five minutes all right five minutes up the water's boiling let's go ahead and put in the noodles now keep in mind in the eat mode the power remains on, it needs to be manually turned off. So I'm putting my noodles right here. Okay, I'm putting my sauce right here. Gotta have flavoring, right? So while that's cooking, of course, I'm gonna stir it, make sure that it cooks gradually. So with the cooking mode, you have to manually cook it. And whenever you feel that it's done, per the directions of the food, then you will manually turn it off. So let's go ahead and stir this noodle. Oh yeah, that looks good right there. Wow. Now I can have an amazing meal. 
But don't forget to turn it off when you're done. And now for my last trick and everybody's favorite, popcorn. So what I'm going to do is first remove the packaging and put the dry kernels into the kettle. So it looks like to me this has extra butter so I don't need to add oil or any spices in there. So I'm putting a good amount in here. All right. There's the kernels. I'm actually surprised there aren't that much in the bag, but we'll see how this turns out. All right, I'll put the cover back on, and now I can select the pop mode, turn it on. All right. Now get a chopstick or something to stir as it's popping. This is going to help out. I might as well time it to. Looks like around the two minute mark. I can hear some fizzle. Snap, crackle, pop. I heard the first pop around the three minute mark. So that's when you would stir it to help it pop better. Oh yeah, there goes one right there. See, that's the first popcorn right there. Cause you need to cover it better. And with the pop function, it automatically shuts off. Okay. Alright, so it looks like it automatically shut off around the 7 minute mark. Let's check up on the popcorn. I know I can smell it and hear it. Look at that, guys. Ooh wee. Look at this popcorn, man. It's just like going to the theaters, right? Now you can enjoy hot drinks, hot meals, and even popcorn on your next camping trip. So as you can see, this is a very powerful 500 watt electric kettle for all of your cooking needs on the go. Definitely give this stoke, voltaic electric kettle a look.